Have you ever got in trouble with some people and it seemed like you suffered the consequences behind their actions and it seems as though they got away with it? Or have you ever did something and immediately you felt guilty? Immediately, God convicted you in your spirit, letting you know, nah, this ain't the way to go. This is wrong. Well, if you ever felt like that, it's a reason. It's a reason behind that. See, when the Heavenly Father has chosen you, a chosen vessel that he's using to do his will, the reason why he convict you immediately when you do things wrong is because he expects more out of you. See, a leader has to be set apart from the crowd in order for them to fulfill their calling. You can't fit in and expect to lead. Sometimes when the Heavenly Father has called you to do something, he's gonna be a little bit more hard on you because he wants you to lead by example. See, God's discipline, when he's chastising us, it's because he loves us. And he want us to unlock our gifts that's already inside of us. But he got to separate you from the crowd. It's going to be times when you're going to have to make a decision. Do I participate in what they doing because it look fun? Or do I study the word of God? Do I follow the ways of God? Every time you choose God, you're going to win. But every time you choose the world, you will always lose. And it will always bring you to a place of lack. Because it's some people out there that's praying on your downfall. They don't want to see you elevate to your greatest potential. So the enemy will send people your way to try to keep you down, to try to keep you isolated from the presence of God. That's why we must keep the Heavenly Father first in all circumstances of our life. And also we learn how to lead by learning who to follow and who not to follow. Think about it. If you following someone that's doing evil things, and you're doing what they doing, guess what? You're going to go in the same place they're going. But if you follow in Lord Jesus and his ways, Lord Jesus went to heaven. Lord Jesus showed us the way to life. And if we're under his discipleship, we too should be leading people to life. So we got to be careful about what we follow and who we follow. Because when the Heavenly Father has chosen you out of the crowd, we have to be more diligent. Because the adversary, the devil, is looking for someone to devour. But it won't be you as long as you keep the Heavenly Father first. Stay focused. I pray this bless you in Jesus name. Amen.